right, Dad Jack's going with blues here. So, hey, look, look what uh, my son-in-law Wes brought me some bl uh, blackfish. This is like the most sought after. You know what? He must really love me because he don't give this fish away. So, uh, but here I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do blackened blackfish, and uh, you know I gotta have. I gotta have a little bit of like a, a, a tartar sauce or. Uh, you know, remoulade or whatever. So, very low on uh, mayonnaise. So this is gonna be like a pickle, like a pickle relish, pretty much. Harley, my friend Harley gave me these. Beautiful, a uh, little spicy uh, pickles, the Greek gourmet pickles. None better than this. So that's it. Just a simple. You know, I could put a little of my blackened seasoning in there, but I think we got enough. This is this is such a good uh, accompaniment to anything blackened. You know, uh, love it. You know, I could put a little bit of paprika, make remoulade, a little Dijon if you wanted, but so green onions, cornichons, and pickles. So, uh, so I got a little bit of broccoli, just dry sauteing it. And uh, that's going to add so much nice flavor. See, it's caramelizing a little bit. And uh, so I have my skillet, you know. So again, you got to be careful. Uh, this is uh, this is super preheated now. So I'm going to put my Daddy Jack seasoning. Um, really, what I want to do is I'm going to put a little bit of this uh, bacon fat in there. But I'm just, it's so hot. And uh, I'm gonna use a little bit of olive oil. And just a little bit of butter. So, uh, what I'm gonna do. So what I do is I'm gonna just drop one side in there to do both sides. Okay. And then I'm gonna hit up with my black and seasoning. The Daddy Jacks. Available at see now we, we gotta we gotta come off, take the top off of this because we need we need a good amount. And when you're blacking it. Okay, so you don't, you know, the old days, you'd have a crazy amount of, uh, you can do it kind of a dry, but it's such a thick, nice thick filet. But no flour. Let that. I said, let the bone. You know, it's hard times you take the bone right out. It just be be careful down that center bone. But that gives you know that holds it all together real nice. It gives us a nice flavor. So we're gonna let that go. Just kind of slow cook it. You don't have to. You can do it on a blast and heat if you're outside or anything. But it'll smoke up the whole house. So we're just gonna let that go, nice and slow. And, uh, but, um, it's funny, you know, blackened, blackening, the first time I saw it was on the, when I was young, before I even was cooking professionally, the great Paul Perdome on the Today Show, I remember it like it was yesterday, making blackened pork chops, that was the start of the craze. Then it was blackened redfish, and then when I had my restaurant down in Tell you, the first restaurant, Chaplin's, 
we were doing black and red fish, and red fish from the Gulf. All of a sudden, it was such a, because of the blackening, it created a shortage that was, uh, was getting fished out. Everybody wanted black and uh, red snapper, a red fish, red snapper on the menus, and so they had to, you know, they, they stopped even, uh, you couldn't even get red fish after a while, but this is the Cadillac of fish. I don't care. I mean, snapper and this, and John Dory, and, you know, um, John Dory, golden sea bass, those are halibut, those are really the elite. Um, right here, see? See, you got a nice, that beautiful color on that. I'm just gonna let that go. And we'll be back. Boy, we'll turn it over here a little bit, and we'll be back. Slow cook it now. Hey, Jack's cool with the blues. Come on in, Axel. You said hello to Axel yet? Hey, check out Axel. He'd be a good boy. He loves fish like the rest of us, don't you? <laughs> huh? All right, so come on in. So, so this piece was blackening so quicker, so I, I kind of slid it over to one side here. That's what you're looking for right there. See, that's, that's what, that's called blackening right there. That's what you want, everything caramelized, all that spice caramelized. Woo! That's it right there, just gonna let it go. Let's try it out. Mm. Just a little bit more. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't overload my blackened seasoning with salt. And uh, I want to hit it with just a little more, just a little more garlic. Step it up a little bit. And, uh, you know, it's kind of meant to be a little on the spicier side, so. And, uh, Alright, we're gonna let that go. That's it, another three minutes on the other side because this this is like kind of cooked from the bottom up with a nice blacking, so we're just gonna finish it off. Got a got a nice broccoli going. And uh, we're about two minutes to touchdown. Alright, what I meant to say was two minutes to splash down, you know, but uh so then Brett Brock brought a, a thought, you know, SpaceX going up. First uh, U.S. Uh, blast off, you know, going to the uh, space station before we had to rely on Russia, you know, to get us there. Now Elon Musk, I don't know how he does it. All this, what, what a mind this guy's got. So, uh, but here it is, we're going in. One thing we don't want to do is overcook it. Don't forget these good scraps. Take that other pan off the fire. These, these stems are my favorite part. Broccoli stems. So uh, that's it. Black and blackfish right there. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> All right. Hey, over here. <laughs> he's, he's taking too much camera time. Hammer time. Camera time. Rhymes. So hey, we're gonna go for this. This is how you eat black and black and redfish, black and snapper. Oh man. And uh, I gotta have a little bit of this on the side. Oh, 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 oh. 
keeps you made a nice salad. That's what we're talking about, nice and healthy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, it's got a crust on it. Mm. See the bone down the middle comes right apart. But look at that nice crust. It doesn't get any better than this. Mm. Wow. You'd pay 30 bucks in a restaurant for this. I might sell it for $29.95. <laughs> but anyway, that's what you want. Those natural flavors coming out. Here you go, Axel. Want a lime, lemon? Oh, I think so. So anyway, you know, we said... <laughs> oh, delicious. Delicious. <laughs> so that was my nephew, Josh. And, and one of the videos, I think it's on my old channel, uh, Chaplin's Restaurant. Look it up on YouTube, Chaplin's Restaurant. But uh, it was classic. You know, I had a few people comment, you know, about that, you know, they thought it was the one guy said he's gonna he's gonna put that on his uh, on his recorder on his phone on ringtone his, on his ringtone. <laughs> he go like that, <laughs> delicious. <laughs> so, so first one that comes through, and tell 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 me which uh, which video it came out. We're gonna send you a blackened seasoning and a and a Sam Myers CD. And maybe, you know, throw, give us your size. Maybe we'll even throw a t-shirt in there. But, Wes, thank you so much for this uh, black in, this uh, blackfish. Probably one of the best fish right here that I've ever had, you know. The, just the whole technique. The black, it's been years since I've done a blackened fish. By the way, going to get into this meal. The quiche, we're going to split on this plate. Mm-hmm. All right. Sounds good. Axel, where you at? He's laying down. You're going to be getting some. He, he uh, had his surgery, came through with flying colors, and he looks so sleek without his collar on. Mm -hmm. And we love you, buddy. So glad you have your back. And Lakeisha Lee <laughs> on the camera, I love you. I love you, honey. And thanks so much for all you do. I love you. Hold on, let me get one more bite of that. That fish is like prehistoric. It's got three sets of teeth. It eats clams and mussels and shrimp and lobster. And it, it, the, the teeth, when they get older, the teeth wear down. And uh, it was like a half hour out of water when I got it home. It was still alive. It was still breathing. It's just crazy how, how, how uh, durable and, and uh, you know, this fish is like no, no other fish out there. The meat is super, super thick. It's, it's awesome in chowder. And uh, the, the, the bodies, the racks, they call them. You, you make some stock out of the racks, you clean the, you know, eviscerate, clean the guts out and everything, and you make a stock and you make a chowder with that blackfish, blackfish chowder, or just use a stock and a fish chowder. It's the best thing you ever ate in your life. And uh, again, Wes, th can't thank you enough. Hey guys, go with the blues. Love you all. Axel, this is for you, my friend. Here, over here. Even eating, the, even eating the black and broccoli. <laughs> what a guy, man. What a savage. 